Hey guys, how you doing? It's Vince here, and I'm here to tackle a couple of issues dealing with apps in the Facebook app, as well as the Facebook Messenger app. Now, not too long ago, and still, media is blowing up the privacy issue with the Facebook Messenger app, uh, labeling it's being able to get into your contacts, your text messages, as well as your camera, uh, and is your location. Um, a lot of people found that uncomfortable, so they were installing the app. But also, the Facebook app itself had access to do similar uh, aspects to, you know, get into your phone, get into your contacts and things like that. So I'm tech and I'm a fan actually of both Android and Apple. Um, and I have a, a, you know, vast use for both. So I wanted to explain to you guys how to disable this uh, in Apple. I haven't found a way to do it for Android yet. I don't see options where you can. So they're left wide open. But uh, as far as Apple, Apple is concerned in their iPhones there is a way you can disable them for having access to those certain areas so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in settings uh, we're gonna scroll up and we're gonna go directly to uh, Facebook first okay so Facebook right here and we're gonna go to settings and as you can see you have notifications privacy you have uh, background app refresh, US cellular data, upload HD, autoplay, the version of the Facebook app you're using, and about. We're going to go to privacy. And as you can see in privacy right here, we have location services, photos, and Facebook. In location services, I have it while I'm using the app. Now, a lot of people are concerned about they don't want Facebook to know where they are all the time. So Apple does give you the option to put never or always. So for some people that have an issue with privacy, a lot, I would use never. But for me, it's fine. I don't mind while I'm using the app. Uh, while I'm not using the app, that could be a problem. So we're going to go out of here. And that's how you disable them from actually having your photos. As you can see right here, I have my photos turned off. Now, a lot of people were concerned about Facebook having access to their photos without their consent. Apple gives you the option to turn it off. So people who have iPhones, this is a big, you know, kudos for you because you have the option manually to turn it off or on. So let's go out of here and let's go to Facebook Messenger, which is the real big one. A lot of people were having problems with. And I can see where when updating an app or forcing a person to use an app, which I did see in a lot of posts, too, that you couldn't just access your messenger through your Facebook app. Now, a lot of people had to go through Google online and log on to their Facebook without using the app because if you use the app it would force you to download Facebook Messenger so let's go to Facebook Messenger and let's click Messenger now as you see these settings again are not available in Android and with this messenger you have notifications privacy background app refresh background app refresh means that you can sync your apps without you always clicking into it and waiting for it to sync or refresh it'll be doing that without you even clicking into it and you do have the option to turn that on or off um, we're gonna go into privacy now here's the big thing that people are gonna really find refreshing location services again you can put never which a lot of people are probably gonna choose that to have an iPhone now when they see this video or while using the app um, that was one of the things that the media was talking about always knowing your location now to access your contacts, your photos, your microphone, and your camera without your consent is really big. And a lot of people found this to be an issue. When I was reading through the blogs, uh, reading a lot of um, media reports that Facebook is over pushing their boundaries, Apple gives you uh, the manual control over this to turn this off so there'll be no worry. Um, this is something that's not available on Android, but I'm pretty sure they're going to have a fix for that soon because that's serious. When you have personal things of your photos, you don't want your microphone always on, especially your camera without your consent from an app that's forcing you to download it. So this should be a refresher for some people. I hope this helps a lot. Um, again, with iPhones, you can manually turn these settings off. Um, and you can have peace of mind when it comes to the privacy setting of this app that drove the media crazy with all the reports that had people deleting it, uh, deleting their Facebook, deactivating their Facebook. Um, and I can see why. So I hope this helps. If there is a fix out for Android, I will be uh, putting a video up for that. Again, um, 
more than just your average consumer. I'm a tech, so I actually like doing stuff like this. Um, I have <laughs> knowledge of both platforms. Um, so if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. Again, this is a video awareness of the Facebook app and the Facebook Messenger app. My name is Vince. You have a great day.